Hey what's up Spartans welcome back to another Halo video now today's video is a very exciting video because there's a new mod that's been released uh, uh, called uh, Halo C multiplayer um, Halo C anniversary multiplayer it's basically been ported uh, into Halo 3 so as you guys can tell what you, what you see here is basically um, Halo Combat Evolve you know so we got the Halo Combat Evolve uh, main menu you know the music uh, this mod is made by Kashira, so all credit goes to her and her uh, other, you know, and, and other people that worked on this uh, uh, project as well. But yeah, this is my first time trying to get out. I've seen images of it, I've seen a bit of videos. I don't want to watch too much of the videos, you know, to the way from the spoilers, you know, I want to like experience it myself. But I've seen some images and it, and it looks absolutely incredible. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go ahead and test it. We're gonna, the map we're going to be uh, testing it on is Blood Gulch. Because it is my favorite map from C. But we'll look at other maps, okay? I'm gonna be using a, a controller for Forge. So we get to fly around on Blood Gulch. Oh god, this dude, this is incredible. Oh, this is. I can't believe. I can't believe, like, I can't believe I'm actually gonna be playing this. Oh my god! Oh, wow! Look at the textures. Oh my days, look at the Magnum. Dude, it feels like Halo Combat Evolve. Bro, coach, look. Guys, this is not Halo CE. This is uh, Halo 3. This is Halo 3. I'm not playing Halo CE. This is running the Halo 3 engine. Oh my days. Dude, this looks amazing. Kashiro, you've done an amazing job. If you're watching this video, I don't know if you're watching this video, but honestly, you've done an amazing job, and you deserve so much, like, you deserve a lot. Absolutely a lot. Like, 343 need to give you a shout out for this, you know? You should get hired by 343 so you can help them to make content. <laughs> We're in for that. Oh, but really though, this looks amazing. Dude, Blockwatch looks amazing in Halo 3. Oh, look at the tank. Dude! Like the art style, it looks so good. Can I destroy this vehicle? Oh my days. Guys. We gotta host this. We gotta host this, man. I wanna play B2B Blood Gulch in Halo 3. We gotta do it. We gotta, we gotta set up a, a, a custom um, game night or something. Um, be sure to join my Discord because I do have a lot of people in my Discord, so I'm gonna try to organize this. Yes, you need a PC to play this mod. It's not, this mod is not for, it's not available for consoles, unfortunately. Uh, maybe one day, maybe one day, if they can look at this project and be like, hey, let's pull this over to uh, to the consoles. Let's uh, drive those small togs. Oh look at the rocket hog. She she's done an amazing job with this. And also and also other people. I uh, look, I love how you get to see your own uh your own legs in Halo Combat Evolve, you know? In Halo CE, the first game never allowed you to do that. You see I have a weapon back. That's cool. Oh uh, look how look how good the armor looks. Wow. This looks Kashiro, you've done an amazing job. I'm gonna keep saying that because you, you, it needs to be reminded. <laughs> I never thought, dude, I never thought like in a million years I, we will be playing Blood Gotch in Halo 3. I thought I'd never see that day coming, honestly. But when MC came to PC, I kind of thought, you know, I had a gut feeling that it could happen, you know, because we were talking about modding. And here we are, we're modding the crap out of Halo 3, you know? I saw this flashlight. You can turn on flashlight, I swear. Did she port that into Halo 3? Because you you could turn on flashlight and multiply in Halo C originally. Uh, so this is the cave. Ah uh, yeah, she added those in. That's pretty cool. And the fact that you can forge on this map. Oh my god. She even got the OS Halo Combival era. The sniper looks really cool. Oh look, it's a flamethrower. Um, I can't believe I'm playing this. It's like a, a dream come true for the fans, you know? For us uh, Halo fans that have been playing Halo Combat Evolve. You could tell she added a bit of textures on the armors. But again, the, the other people that also worked on this, you guys have done a really uh, amazing job as well. Oh wait, I do have flashlight on. Oh, I turned it on, okay. Wait, how, how do I turn that on? Oh, so, yeah, she ported over the flashlight. How do I turn it on though? Well, but I'm using the controller, so I don't know. I don't have to turn this on. So that's awesome. Wow. Oh, I remember this bit. I used to hide in here, dude. When I used to play original uh, original CE. Alright, uh, let's go check out the bases. Yeah, the textures are up here. This was never in the original game, but this looks so much better. Oh, 
Shotgun. Shotgun, man. You can't mess with a shotgun from CE. Dude, it feels, looks like Halo Combined Evolve, man. Look at it. Dude, this is what this is what I kept on bragging on about modding, you know, to you guys, like how modding could change Halo, how it could create that longevity for this game, you know? This is amazing. Wow. Let's try out the ghost. You can't boost with this uh, with this ghost, just like from Halo C. So yeah, I've noticed she added the trees. Uh, this was never in the original, originally in CE. Uh, but I think she wanted to decorate this map to feel like it belongs in Halo 3. Do you see what I mean? I, I, I think she wasn't really going for the for the replicant. She wants to like bring like, I don't know, she wants to make Bloodgotch in, in its own, uh, what's his name, in, in its own identity. Let's go up top of here. That's my favorite place to do this night. awesome. I love the hood as well. Wow. It doesn't even really feel like a mod almost. It feels like this is how it's meant to be in Halo 3. <laughs> uh, I'm talking about the map. Yeah, I'm not going to walk through every map because that's probably take a long time for you guys, you know, to watch the video, you know. Good to see the Halo C Magnum in Halo 3. We're gonna host this. We have to host this. If you guys are watching this video, be sure to subscribe. You know, be sure to join our Discord. Mainly Discord because Discord, you know, I'm gonna we're gonna do a custom game now. We have to do it. Um, and be sure be sure to follow me on Twitch. I am gonna be streaming this as well. So once we have a, a stack going, uh, we can definitely uh, uh, you know play this together. The rocket launcher. That looks incredible. He even got the reload. I love the reload for the rock launcher in CE. It looks so satisfying. For those who are asking, like, oh, uh, can you host some host this on the custom game browser? No, you can't. Unfortunately, uh, they they don't have the future where we can uh, host uh, modded maps like this on the server browser. And this is why I've been telling everyone we need uh, modded servers on the server browser. So if I'm modding Blood Gulch in Halo Three, it needs to appear on the server browser. And not just that. It needs to have like a future where if people see my map and you know the PC players because obviously this mod is only on PC so so if people see my map right they can just uh, click on the, the server and it will automatically download the mod for them it's almost like how Halo uh, Custom Edition has it you know where you get to uh, select a modded servers and then you you know you can download uh, the map automatically you know you don't have to uh, go on Nexus or something um, but yeah but they are going to be bringing uh, Steam Workshop so that's really good Really incredible. Alright, let's go to next map. Let's go next map. Oh my word. Dude, it looks so good. Guys, I'm not just saying that. I'm not just saying I'm not putting out this this fake reaction. I swear to god, I'm not even doing that. It, it actually looks really good. Looks incredible. Can I can I come up here? Oh shit, you can. Oh no, wait. Oh no, you can't. <laughs> Oh, that'd be pretty cool. Uh, oh, dude, it looks so amazing. Oh, wow, you added a score. Dude, that's pretty awesome. Wow, she added a score here. <laughs> this is awesome, dude. I'm so impressed with this. I'm so, like, happy, man, like, what, what the community can be able to pull off. Like, mods like this will keep MCC alive. Morning is the way to go, man, for this game. Foreign Ontario. That. This looks incredible. Like, I'm always seeing a lot of hater content creators are talking about this mod. Like, I've seen, like, people that meant this, you know, I think he mentioned it, but I don't know, it's not getting that recognition, like, that it deserves, you know? It, like, it, oh my, oh, this collision here. Yeah. That's pretty cool. Okay. I can probably hide here. 
this uh, this mod needs to explode, man, in the Halo in the Halo community. What do you guys think about the assault rifle? You guys like it? Seems all right. But I do think they could use a little bit of work. It feels just like Combat Evolve. We, we gotta play this together. We gotta set up a custom game now. But the thing is, guys, I don't have many people that have a PC to play mods, or, you know, to play with mods, and there's, there's, like, it's hard to go for plays like that. And uh, I don't know, if you guys have any friends that love modding and hate a combatable, do invite them to our, our Discord server. Uh, we definitely set up a custom game night. Uh, I'll definitely be streaming as well. Uh, maybe the streaming a bit can, uh, you know, make us stand out so we can uh, get more people in uh, that are on PC uh, who are willing to download the mod. Uh, I really want to host this. I really, really want to host this. And just to think, modding has... Well, modding started about... When did it start? Like, almost a year ago? And, and look at mod, how much progress, like... I'm not just talking about this mod specifically. I, like, I've been playing other mods, and they are absolutely astonishing. Like, and there's already been so much progress. Look at my sniper on my weapon back. That looks funny. Was that always there? I don't recognize that being there. Or am I tripping? I don't know. I don't think I originally see it had that fallen on a pillow. Look at, look at the texture. It's not... It doesn't have that copy and paste thing, like those patterns that you see. Oh man, the water looks amazing. There's no way, like, she, they actually pulled this off, dude. This is unfreaking believable. Unfreaking believable. And these other people just work at home, man. Like, doing their free time, and and look what they what they're able to pull off here. Like, they're giving us, like, they're giving us every single map from from Halo Combat Evolve. I think we. Give this map a good look, so... And the fact that you get to forge around the map... <laughs> oh my god, that's like a dream come true. Like, I always used to think, because every time I hop on Custom Edition, I look at these maps, like, I look at these fan-made maps, right? And I look at maps like... Uh, Huge Ass, Cold Snap, you know, Extinction. I used to think to myself, imagine this map was the map was in Halo 3, and I would just, like, fly around the map, you know? I would be spawning vehicles in. Can I spawn vehicles? Oh, look! So yeah, you get you get spawn in like the sea warthog, you know. Like, who who would have thought we'd be doing this? Who would have thought, guys? This is this is amazing. Like, I don't care what you guys say. Halo to see is is in its new prime. Forget Halo three back in two thousand seven, whatever. Like, I don't know, man. This is something else, dude. Like, this is amazing. This is absolutely amazing. Oh my god. Now, Halo CZ has entered a new prime. Like this is this is like the prime that we never saw Halo in. It's insane. Look at the Banshee. I don't feel like the Banshee's lid is closed properly. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, check out the next map. Here we are. Look at this. Oh wow, dude. I was gonna say, where are the bloody warthogs? Oh man. Oh god. Look what they did to the ocean. Dude, this field looks it looks incredible, it looks amazing. Oh my god. Wow, dude, can you imagine the campaign? All my days, I just thought of something. Like, imagine the campaign. Because uh, Halo 3 sports a uh, uh, four-player co-op, we can now actually play four-player co-op in Halo CE, right? So, like, if, if you know, if they uh, ever decide to pour over the campaign um, into um, into Halo 3, Halo, you know, Halo Combat Evolves campaign, uh, we get to we get to do four-player co-op, you know, at last. <laughs> Oh god, this looks incredible. It's so dark up there. Wow, look at that. 
Look at the the the, the effects, like the lighting effects. It's the ground. Oh my god, look at the magnum. I like how it blends in. Dude, just imagine that the campaign, like where where we get to play story mode, four play co-op, you know, for Hater CE, which we never had. It's gonna be a dream come true. Oh wow. Dude, this looks incredible. We can fly around, we don't need to take the water off. Oh, does this ladder work? Let's see. Oh, I can't climb up. Oh, wait. Uh, so, okay, to climb up here, you gotta press uh, the jump button. Okay. That's incredible. Oh, oh so this, this doesn't have collision. I thought, I thought it was just only one of the barricades had issues. So I guess it's all... That's all good. This looks... This is incredible. Let's go to the Pelican Crash. Oh, this was never in, in the original map. Oh, that's pretty cool. She added the Hitter 3 Cheap Warthog. Oh, we get to break that. Okay. Can you enter this Pelican? Like, imagine playing Infection on this map, guys. Freaking, oh, it's gigantic. But playing on these playing on these Halo C maps, like it's just, it will be incredible. Playing Infection on here. <laughs> I'm gonna leave this uh, mod in the link for you guys to download. It, it took me a while to download. To be fair, I don't know why. I do have a fast internet, but yeah, it took a long time for me to download. This this looks incredible. That's, I think this is probably the best mod that we have uh, yet. But you can see a few more. This isn't this is it, it is in beta, so they could you know do more with it. Should we enter the water? Let's see. Oh, okay. The water isn't. I thought it was in very deep. Where is it? If I keep going. You know, I'll probably end up streaming this game. Uh, this mod at some point. I gotta set up a, a stack. I gotta uh, get a stack going. How far can I go? Bloody hell. Wow. Dude, look how far I'm going. I have to play the infection here and then. <laughs> oh god. And then you, and then the last man standing will be. It's insane, dude. What? That's insane. Look how far I am from the land. From the eyes of. Oh shit. I don't wanna. I oh, can kill myself? I can start a new run. So guys, uh, if you guys want to play, prefer playing on hosting uh, for some game night, you know, we've got to bring in a lot of players because, you know, the maps that we're going to be playing, uh, they're going to be pretty, pretty, pretty huge. And because uh, Halo, Halo C has massive maps. They're all, every, like almost all the maps are quite massive. So if we're going to be playing Halo C multiplayer in, in Halo 2, we're going to need a lot of people who, uh, we have a PC and uh, who know like how to you know download the mod. Um, I mean, some people don't even know how to do a drag and drop file. Sometimes there are some people like that. <laughs> but yeah, honestly, we should uh, host this. Just you know, like I said, join my Discord. You know, we can uh, get everything organized. All right, should we uh, test out another map? Which other map should we test out? 
We could do a uh, Timberland. Timberland's from that. I like Timberland. But yeah. All credit goes to them, uh, to the modders. They've done an amazing job. I like how she got the uh, Halo 3 UI um, and the backgrounds from the um, Halo Combiner role. She kept in mitts. Um, they kept in mitts. I don't know who did the UI stuff, but, but yeah. They've uh, done an amazing job with that. I've seen videos of this. Wow. It's incredible. This is what the in base looks like. Look the textures man. The texture looks so shiny. How do I use my equipment? Well, you can't use that. Can I do wheel? Let me see if I can do wheel. I don't think you can't because... Yeah, I think you can't do wheel because... This is CE and obviously it's trying to stay to its original form. Why can't I find the buddy Magnum? This looks incredible. Let's take the water. Uh, sorry, let's take the ghost. Yeah, this uh, this looks amazing. Absolutely incredible. Come up here. Ah, oh. that'd be pretty cool if we did. <laughs> also, I don't know if the warthogs are. I haven't noticed it. Do the warthogs drive like C? Nah, they don't have the same. Uh, Physics, you know, the way they drive. I love the physics, uh, you know, the driving physics, like, like the way you control your warthog. I really like it in, in Halo Combat Evolve. Oh my god, what's that? But yeah, it's uh, absolutely amazing. Absolutely love the mod. Absolutely love it, dude. We just gotta host it. That's my my only concern is it's just hosting it. Like, because every time, because like, I have problems like this every time. Like, every, like when there's like whenever there's a, a really good map, but the problem is you can't really play it because there's no one to play with, you know. And just it could get boring. And uh, this is what I'm saying, man. People really need to, uh, you know, swap the uh, modded server, you know, on the on the server browser. You know, make it available for mod uh, for modded servers. And you know, we get players joining in and downloading the mod automatically you know like they gotta do something with that really important because i feel like because i feel like you know if, if a lot of models are going to make you know port maps like this you know make maps you know like, like this then i don't know they're just gonna be wasting their energy you know and, and their time because like because in the end no one's gonna be playing on, playing on those maps together you know so these 243 if you're watching this i don't know who's watching this but whoever's watching this at like people three just do that, okay? Uh, make this mod available on server browser and uh, make it downloadable. So whoever clicks on the server, like like, like right now, is able to download it. But yeah, guys, I'm gonna be ending the video here. Uh, honestly, this is a and it's an amazing mod. You guys need to download this. I want you guys to download this because I'm gonna be hosting a custom game night. I'm not sure when. Uh, join our Discord so we can talk about it. You know, set like a schedule. Uh, but yeah, be sure to subscribe for more hater content. Be sure to follow us on Twitch, and I'll see you hater fans in the next video. Take care. Bye.